the channel. Today is Saturday. We're headed out because we have something really fun to do and we're getting ready for something really fun. I don't know if we've even explained it to you guys. My second order! I can't show you the address. Yeah, so Seki, Sophie, Seki. Sophie has been selling jewelry. If you guys want to check it out, what's your Instagram? Bracelets underscore by underscore, underscore Sophie. Sophie. One, two, three, four. That is Sophie's Instagram page where she's selling really adorable bracelets. She sold another and then she has other people interested. Yeah. And this is her first shipment to the States. She's trying that out today. So we're gonna go and mail off her newest bracelet, but we're gonna do something else and we're gonna take you guys along. Last night, Sam and Gabby had an opportunity to pursue Gabby's love of fear and terror and go on a haunted trail. And I'm gonna show you guys the highlights of the haunted trail that they went on and you guys can see for yourself who's the brave one of the bunch, Gabby or Sam. And then we'll meet you guys back here. We're gonna go put the horses in and then we'll meet you where we're going and tell you what we're doing. We're up and we're walking. Gabby's leading the way, she's gonna get. I know, that's why you need a, that's why you need a little light. Uh oh. <laughs> 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 the dim light. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Chainsaw. Blood. What about in there? I'm going there. The cabin. Alright. Keep going. I see a cabin. I see a cabin in the woods. Whoa, 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 <laughs> you got yeah. <laughs> oh, we have to go through here. Come through. <laughs> you grabbed my leg. I'm happy now. You're happy now? Yeah, I thought they weren't gonna touch me. I think they're gonna go for you. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Oh, this is what I'm terrified of. Oh no, this is Gabby's worst nightmare. Oh, Dolls God. everywhere. Dolls. Oh, you know, there's actually an island with a bunch of dolls on it. Oh, I've seen that one. It's haunted. Yeah. Where are we going? <laughs> oh, smoke. And there's arms. Right in front of you. <laughs> wow! <laughs> holy jeez, man. Holy jeez. People walking around in here. Oh, well, there's a guy standing. <laughs> Alright, so we are in Value Village, which is a second hand store that's local to us. And we are buying no some stuff to make Finn's costume. Can you guys guess what he's going to be? The, whoops. These are gorgeous, Sam. You are so good at finding stuff. I love it. Oh, here it is. Ten bucks. Ten bucks, and I gotta cut it up. Yeah. So that one would be good to cut up. Yeah, I like it. I like I don't know the. But this one would be good to cut up because look, it's got two different mm. sides. I think it'll be okay. I also found this bracelet, French friendship bracelet kit, which she probably won't like. Or we can get these kind of stuff, this kind of stuff. Yeah, that's cute too, but so this, what? I don't know. I don't want to tell you guys. Yeah, I like this stuff way better. I don't know if it's going to be good to make though. But I think it'll be okay. So that's enough, like two different Yeah, colors. yeah. Or we can make them a leopard. Shh, tell them. So do you like it? It looks brand new, like it's never ever been open. Is there beads? 
So it's just friendship. So it's just like braiding and stuff. See? Oh. But I mean, yeah, it's got everything. It has these things mm -hmm. and whatever those are for. Yeah. And to measure your wrist. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of neat. Yeah, I want it. All right, we are headed home now. That was it. Like, we just went to the post office. Oh, post office. The post office, I think, is closed. And Sophie really wanted to go to the craft store, but we should have told him before we drove out of the building. <laughs> We're headed home to build Finn's costume. Sam's gonna help this year. Last year, if you guys didn't remember, Sophie was, uh, Finn was a sheep, hey. and I had to do it, and I, I suck. Last year, what are you talking Not about? Not that much, it was mostly me, and I suck at decorations, but hey, I uh, did last costumes. Year too. Yeah, but Sam is really good at it, so I have high hopes, Sam. High hopes that you're gonna make Finny be the best darn thing that we've ever um, made. Gabby broke the bad news, saying that he's gonna just go wild with it on. Yeah, he's probably gonna go wild. We're gonna we're gonna try him out with it. Like just tie pieces to his mane and tail. Costumes are hard for horses for sure. Like especially horses like Finn. But I don't know. I think Finn did fine last year. So we're gonna try it. We're gonna see how Finn does. What do you guys think? Do you think that costume classes and at a Halloween show is a good thing, or do you think it's a bad thing that we're just causing distress to our horses, or are we desensitizing them? Let me warm up. First. Yeah, that's why we warm up first, and that's why our trainer will warm us up <laughs> first. It's been such a rainy, yucky, awful day. I don't know if you guys can see down there, but Penny's watching for us. She's like, come, give me my supper. <laughs> She's like, come on, right now. The trailer is all loaded up. I don't know if I told you guys, but Sophie has a show tomorrow. Gabby's obviously not gonna be in the show. Some of you guys are concerned. I saw messages from people that said like, you know, you've been jumping him too much. And like, we have not even jumped Chino in a long time. He had a long time off after Trillium. He has had a bunch of little teeny tiny issues that have happened, most of them not connected. He's had sore feet because he has sensitive, because he has thin soles and flat feet. He's had um, his back end. We've been trying to um, to strengthen it like our vet suggested. We've been doing a lot of stuff working with our vet and our farrier and it's just a bunch of different things. He's a long bodied horse and he's just the kind of horse that doesn't have the best comp confirmation to keep himself together. I don't know what it is, but some of you guys have mixed up a lot of the things and thrown them together and made up things that aren't completely not true and and are sending me messages saying you know you shouldn't have done this and you shouldn't have done that i saw a message about penny saying that their horse had surgery and they shouldn't be that they have to rehab for a really long time before they ride them penny's been rehabbing for such a long time we walked over poles for a long time and then i rode her over poles but mostly walked ride once with boots on then we walk her around the property. We're getting ready to be able to ride her around the property. It's been weeks. She has never had surgery. Surgery is definitely a whole different ball game than being lame or having a weak suspensory ligament. But anyways, I know it's really difficult for, for you guys to follow the whole journey because we don't vlog everything. We don't share everything. You guys don't know like all the things that we talk about with our vets and with our trainers, and so I understand. But rest assured, Chino has not been jumped, he's not been overworked, we've been slowly, slowly, slowly doing a lot of pulls, 20 minutes each ride, like following directions perfectly. Yesterday he tripped, it was unfortunate, it was night at night time, it was a fluke. They don't always, he doesn't always trip. Anyway, we have plans, we have secrets, they're coming out to try and change things up a bit and soon you guys will all know so hold on to your hats the day by day family is changing it up again trying to do the best that we can and that's what you guys should know is that we do the best that we can with the information that we have we have we utilize every service available to us she knows had chiropractor and vet and farrier and massage therapist all in the last month. Like we are extra careful about 
making sure that he's comfortable so with with what we can do like we don't have all the control we don't get to choose everything so anyway I just wanted to tell you that as we race to the barn to check on Chino and to get Finny ready for tomorrow's show Are you excited Sophie yeah all right so this is the costume Lion. Well, three, one, yeah, three of them. Three different colors. So I'm gonna add three together. You have three different colors? Yeah. yeah. It's gonna look good. That one should go on the bottom. It's gonna look good. Yeah, don't complain. Dad knows what he's doing. I love it. What? No, I hate it. I love it. And it's gonna go like. Oh, oh he's gonna kill you. <laughs> he's no. not gonna kill anybody. Uh uh. Wait. I see just tie it around his neck. Okay. I like it. What? So that's good. And then move this up because the brown band is too down. Yeah, we can move it. I like it. I like it. Can't wait to show you guys. Okay, Sophie, you should pack up all your um tacks because you have to take it home and put it in the trailer and get it all cleaned. Tacks. Tacks. You have to help me carry it all out. Can you help me carry it all out? Can you help me carry it all out? Sure. All right, so this is it so far. This is yeah. Finney's costume. Wow. wow. Are you gonna put it like down here as well? There we go. Have you guys guessed? Have you guys guessed? It looks like a wig. You probably already know because I'll probably put it in the title of the video. And we're littering. All over the floor. We had this huge bag of stuff and now we're almost finished. But it's nice and soft material too. So hopefully he likes it. You might need to cut it. Uh no, it's gonna be covered. Or no, it won't be covered. It doesn't matter. He can This have... part's gonna be like covered. You need to do his bridal path. Oh, that is awful. That's an awful thing. He's like, oh man, what's happening? I can tell. You don't come at night and just groom me for nothing. So uh, Chino should be fine today, but I brought a carrot to do some carrot stretches with him. Yeah, you're gonna have to like soak it in water. It's it's gonna be cold tonight, so we don't want to like soak him. But even his legs are gross. We picked a good day to get disgusting. All right, we're checking Chino out, taking him for a walk, do some carrot stretches, see what the heck is happening with him. So Chino had a sore back and then he had a sore pelvis and then he had sore front feet in the summer and then that's was better then he had an abscess and then he had trip last night so all different little things that all roll into a small amount of space makes it seem like he's falling apart he doesn't look too happy though does he all right so i sent a video to brandon and he, he when he tripped yesterday he fell like on his front and pulled the muscle in his shoulder and you could tell and you can see that it's still sore so I'm gonna call the massage lady our massage lady two times in a month <laughs> she's gonna come and fix up our Chino boy in the last two months Chino's been lame in three of his legs based on like back shoulder so many different things he's 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 ruined them all but we're Yeah, Brandon worked really hard on him last night. He did a lot of massage stuff on him. And he might just need time to heal. You know, when you pull a muscle, it just feels sore for a while. But I'm still gonna have the massage therapist come and see what she says, because she's amazing. I love her. I love all of our support team. He does. He, he needs has to... bangs, right? <laughs> no, you need to look it. If you... <laughs> he's gonna be a lion. Kind of looks. Once he goes, he's gonna knock off. Does he look like a lion? No. <laughs> Good job, Sam. He, he does look like cute. He, just he looks on like. The All right, put some on the bottom. No, because we're gonna have to do the straps up. So do the straps. Well, he could be um, one of those woolly mammoths from Star Wars. Chewbacca. No, the woolly I mammoth. I like him. The guys with the. Uh, I mean, he's being good with it. The with the little spears. They have spears he's like, I feel warm and, and cozy. They finally gave me a blanket. You know, <laughs> wow. You can't see me because it's dark and it it's like 618 and we have to go home so he has to clean all of her tack pack the thing the trailer and get Finn looks like a lion does he actually look like a lion? no I said he doesn't look like a lion 
I don't know. Like, I don't know. It doesn't look like a lion. I think it needs to be cut. Some of it has to be cut. I have a picture of what I wanted to I look like. Here, and also, so. I wanted to have like the front because, but they don't want to put front. I think he we should. He will kill me. Because he will kill Sophie. He hates when his forelock is in his face. Yeah, so anyways. Yeah, yeah, anyways, we're going home, take care of our own horses. I'm excited to reveal our big change coming up. I don't know when we should do it. When should we do it? Um, when it's done. Well, uh, want. all right, uh, keep watching, you guys. Keep watching. There's a secret coming up. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the way you are.